Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be a project use it up update for my spring project. So basically this project is for all of the body care that I want to use up in the springtime, which spring officially starts in a few days. I think we just had daylight savings time change. So yeah, I'm officially in spring mode. I know I just did the intro like a few weeks ago, but I already have a ton of updates on products for you guys. So I just figured I'd go ahead and do another update. So let's get started with the good stuff, all of the empties. So I had a lot of stuff that was like literally one use away from being done. So I'll start off with that. I had Sugared Cherry Crisp. Um, I literally only had like one use left. I had already cut it open in the last update. I'm really sad to see this go. It's amazing. Um, yeah, I really hope they bring it back next year. And then I also finished off a body oil. This is the Mineral Co body oil. This is from that like time they tried to do like a whole mineral line. Um, I liked it. The scent was okay. And um, that actually is how I figured out how I liked um, body oils. So now I know that I like them. Um, the next thing that I have is the Coconut Mint Drop Body Lotion. I was very close to finishing this last time. Here was the line. Um, so I really had like maybe five, three, or three, four, five. I don't know how many uses I had left, but it wasn't a lot. And so this was finished pretty quickly. Something that really surprised me that I was not expecting is the Sleep Aromatherapy Black Chamomile Body Lotion. I finished it. Like, what? Um, I even, like, had to take the top off and, like, pour out the rest and, like, slap it on my hand, you know, to get the last bit out. But, yeah, I finished it. So, this took me quite a while. Um, I think I'd had it in my project for, like, six to eight months, um, just, like, steadily using it. And you really can't see through this and when you measure it it's kind of not accurate since this is a glass bottle so it weighs a lot um but yeah i finished it um i don't think i'm really not a big fan of the aromatherapy to be honest with you um those kind of scents aren't my favorite i really like bakery fruity um stuff like that um yeah so it's not my favorite scent but it still is good um definitely recommend if you're looking for something like super relaxing at nighttime um this is a good one but i probably won't repurchase it and then i also had the christmas candy cane from last update i think i had already cut this open i had like three more uses out of it so this is officially finished and then I also have some hand soap. So I had the coconut mint drop that I put in last um, update. It was right here and we just, we finished that in like less than a week. This was in our downstairs bathroom. I really liked this scent. And then we have Love Ya A Latte Whipped Espresso. This was our hand soap in me and my brother's bathroom upstairs. Loved it. There's still like maybe one use left, but I'm just considering it an empty. This was so good. It was espresso bean, creamy vanilla, and whipped sugar. It smelled just like coffee. It smelled so good. I loved this so much. And the last thing that I finished up is the Winter Candy Apple Confetti Moisturizing Body Wash. This was really good. Um, I really like Winter Candy Apple. I don't think I would actually like it in anything besides a shower gel, though. Um, I feel like it's just like a really good shower scent though. It, it smelled so good in the shower. I really like this formula. Besides the fact that it has microplastic beads inside of it, I wish they didn't have that. But besides that, I do like these um, moisturizing body wash formulas. And yeah, this went kind of quick. Um, it had been in since the winter project. So maybe like four months to use it up. Um, th this wasn't the only body wash I used up. I mean like that I was using at the time, but yeah. Finish this one up, it was really, really good. Okay, let's get into what I will be replacing all of the empties with. So the first thing for the Winter Candy Apple Shower Gel, I'm going to be replacing it with Vanilla Mocha Cafe. This is from last fall. This is Cozy Cappuccino, Vanilla Orchid, and White Tonka Bean. I'm gonna go ahead and mark this. I used it yesterday, so it's a little bit below where I had it before, but this was in my fall project, and I never finished it, and I kind of feel weird leaving stuff like half used in my collection, so I'm just gonna go ahead and try to finish it. Um, this smells so good. This is definitely going to be like um, like a weekend use for me though, because I don't think like a coffee scent at night is very, I don't know, I just don't think I'll like that. But yeah, this will be really, really good to be using on weekends. That's why I used it yesterday. Yesterday was Saturday, I'm pre-recording. Um, but yeah, I really, really love this scent. And then I'm glad to have something that's already like a little bit easy to finish. So that will be really good. 
So for the Sugar Cherry Crisp Body Cream, I already replaced it last month, but I do have something that I want to put instead of the Sleep Black Chamomile. I want to put in a second lotion, and that is going to be the Vanilla Mocha Cafe Lotion. And this one is pretty accurately marked right about here. Um, that's where it will be starting in the project, but I feel like these two together will be really good to use. And then to replace Christmas candy cane, I will be putting in the Happy Easter Sweet Bunny Berry Hand Cream. It's so cute. I'm really excited to use this um, since Easter is coming up. Uh, this doesn't have any notes on it, but to me it just smells like jelly beans. So this will be really good to use when it starts to get warmer too. So this will be cute. I mean like literally looking at it, pulling it out, <laughs> it's just gonna like put a smile on my face. Another new thing that I'm going to go ahead and put in is this Pretty as a Peach Shower Gel Mini. Um, I don't know, I just figured maybe I'll want like a fresh and fruity shower gel to use. And I actually, I think I put this in for one month in the summer, so I do have a couple of updates on it. But yeah, it was right, it's we're going to be right here. It's where we're starting in the collection. Um, everybody knows Pretty as a Peach, it's just like a very fruity very fruity shower gel and i feel like this will be good to start off spring so i will have vanilla mocha cafe pretty as a peach and then i have to update you guys on santa's blueberry shortbread so this one i have a little bit of progress on we are right about here i was really focusing on finishing up winter candy apple so i didn't use this too much but i still have some use on it so it was right here and now we're to here pretty good this is a good scent i love it it smells so yummy. It's just like super blueberry-y and like a little bit bakery. And yeah, I've really, really been enjoying it. For lotion, I do have an update on Twinkling Nights. Um, it's not much use, uh, but I did get some use out of it because I was focusing on finishing up those other two. But um, here's the progress on that one. So yeah, steady, slow, steady progress. But I'm really loving the scent of this and figuring out that I kind of like florals as long as it's jasmine. So that's been pretty fun. For hand cream, I'm still using Mary Cookie. Um, this one has been, it smells so good. No joke. I love it so much and it's like a joy to use at work. So I've been using this steadily. It's kind of like getting to where I'm gonna have to cut it open soon, so this will probably be used up pretty soon. For body creams, I have Pink Velvet Cupcake in right now, and this one was unused at eight ounces last time, and now we're at 7.3 ounces, so I used about one ounce. No, not one ounce, 0.7 ounces. But I really love this scent, it's, it's very good. <laughs> I've been loving using this. For soaps, I have updates on a few of them. So I had in Coconut Lime Verbena, the little owl be there thing. Um, I have update on this one. Let me go ahead and mark the line. So we were about right here when it came into the project a few weeks ago and now we're down to here. This is now in our downstairs bathroom, so it's getting a lot of use. It'll definitely be done by the next update. And so the next soap that we'll be using downstairs is Kitchen Mandarin Purely Clean. This one is currently um, at our kitchen sink. So I can't really tell where these are at, but I wanna say it's like almost at the top. Um, I guess I'll go ahead and mark it just for consistency sake. But yeah, um, this smells really good. It's actually a really good kitchen scent. I've been loving it. Yeah, it's like a very, very fresh citrus. And yeah, we're gonna use that one next. For the bathroom upstairs, I decided to put in Hip Hop Hooray. This is Sprinkled Donut. It is a buttercream, milk, and sweet vanilla. I think this smells really good. I'm very excited to use it. Um, it's super cute and festive for Easter time. And yeah, I'm just really excited to get some use out of this and to start using it. Let me go ahead and mark it. Even though we're at like the very top, I'm still gonna mark it. And then I am gonna put in another one. I'm gonna put in Raspberry Tangerine. This is Wild Raspberries Fresh Tangerine and Lemon Zest. This smells super good and fruity. And I feel like I'm gonna put this at the sink once we're done with, I mean, once Kitchen Mandarin goes to the bathroom sink, this will go to the kitchen sink. You get my, you get my drift there. Uh, but yeah, it smells really nice, fresh and fruity and a little bit like, um, zesty with the citrus in there so 
yeah i really love the packaging on this one too this whole line was very beautiful for perfumes i don't have much to update you on i didn't really use the ariana grande one a lot i tried to use the lake and sky one a lot we're down to here now i probably should be marking this because i thought i would finish it so fast but since it's an oil it's been kind of hard to use it um so i try to use this every day at work sometimes i just don't and i forget but i'm really trying to finish that up next i have the fine fragrance mist and i still have frosted wonderland in and here is the update since the last um update we were up here and now we're down to here it's literally almost done it smells so good my coworker really loves this i've been spraying it in the office area like after we eat lunch and he's been really liking this it's basically just coconutty so it's like a nice simple scent so it's not overwhelming but it's gonna be done really soon so very very grateful for that because it's been a long time coming as far as velvet sugar i honestly have not used this a lot i've been really focusing on using frosted wonderland as much as i can so i haven't even used this really since the last update but i mean yeah i want to focus on it once um i finished up with frosted wonderland i might even roll this out um come next update i don't know yet it's it's still a good scent but it's kind of like I'm not really going anywhere and this is kind of like a going out i want other people to smell me scent so yeah the last thing that i have an update on is the pink velvet cupcake fine fragrance mist i have been using this a lot um just like when i get home or just like randomly if i'm home throughout the day um so it does have a little bit of progress on it which i'm very proud of so this is from the last time to this time so now we're right here i hate this packaging you can't see through it so you can't see your progress but yeah i've really been focusing mainly on these two um i might put in a different fine fragrance mist come next update once this one's gone i don't know we'll we'll have to see but i'm really loving pink velvet cupcakes so far it smells delicious, just like super berry-y, and I've been loving putting it together with the body cream. It's just been like a really, really good spring mood combo. So that's everything for my update for my project Use It Up. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Let me know down below something that you've been loving using so far for spring. I think for me, it really has been Pink Velvet Cupcake, and I'm super excited to start using the Easter-themed hand soap. So. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you liked this video, then like, comment, and subscribe down below, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!